Now, this this was something they showed me last week. I guess it was Wednesday or Thursday. The producers of the program said, look at this. And it, we were so chock full of stuff to do, I didn't get to it. And then I saw a newspaper story on Friday where this magazine or comic book was going to hit the streets today. Uh, who was that thrash man? They've totally redone the lawn, uh, Lone Ranger and Tonto. Here's the comic book as it appears now. And just, just a couple things that we want to point out to you. Turn to the first page of this thing and you'll see a major change. That's Tonto decking the Lone Ranger, ladies and gentlemen. Um, <clears throat> in the 1880s, this is political correctness. They're denying this. By the way, people who put this out are tops, which uh, baseball cards, bubble gum, and so forth. Then if you turn to the next crucial page, uh, you will see Tonto denying any allegiance to the Lone Ranger. I am not his Indian. I'm not anyone's Indian. I'm Tonto. This is just incredible. This is Many people are going to have trouble sleeping at night with this profound change. And then there's, I guess, where, they all, where all this action is taking place, some southwestern state, there's a governor there. And take a look at the picture of this governor. Who do you think? <laughs> and, Ron, the only good thing about that is, and look, I haven't read this. I must tell you, I have far more productive things to do with my time to read comic books. So I don't know. But somebody else is, is the governor portrayed positively or negatively here? Does anybody know? Negatively. It figures. I didn't even have to read it to assume that.